Welcome to H2K Infosys. H2K Infosys is a e-verified business based in Atlanta, Georgia, United States. We provide 100% job-oriented, instructor-led, face-to-face, true live online software training programs. It also includes access to Cloud Test Lab with software tools. We provide live project for you to work on. We also provide assistance with mock interviews, resume preparation and review, and job placement assistance. H2K Infosys is trusted by so many students across the world. H2K Infosys provides world-class services in IT training with real-time project work for corporates and individuals, special IT training for MS students in the United States, software design development, QA manual and automation, performance testing and maintenance, IT staff augmentation, job placement assistance and tech support. I have started up an organization in four different parts of the globe. So I have started up a consultancy in four different parts of the globe. Find one in uh, India. So let me put it on an So I have started up an organization. So uh, a consultancy, one in US one in India, one in Germany and the other in UK. Fine. So you guys, uh, uh, the, 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 the students who have enrolled themselves in US, the students who are residing in the US will enroll themselves in US consultancy and the students who have enrolled themselves who are, who are residing in UK, they will enroll themselves in UK and the students who are residing in India they will uh, enroll themselves in India consultancy and the students who have enrolled themselves in Germany they will enroll themselves in the Germany fine so as a CEO as a CEO I mean I'm a CEO of the consultancy so I would like to know how many students have enrolled in my US consultancy how many students have enrolled uh, in UK consultancy and how many students have enrolled themselves in Indian consultancy and how many students have enrolled themselves in Germany consultancy. Well, as a CEO, I should know how my organization is performing, how my consultancy is doing in these parts of the globe. Okay, it's, I mean, I need to know uh, because based upon the inputs which I get it, okay, based upon the inputs which I get it from the these consultants, from these parts, I'll take up a decision and I'll make a decision and this decision would help me to grow my business okay this decision will impact my business so information is always required for me as a CEO to to take it from these these consultancies which are located across the different parts of the globe so at the end of the day I'll call up US consultancy and ask so what what is the business being done by my US consultancy Okay, and after that, I'll, I'll hang up the phone and call the UK consultancy. The similar way I'll do with the Indian consultancy and the Germany consultancy. So by the end of the day, I'll get the sales or the revenue generated by my consultancy in this part of the globe. Fine. So this information would be it would be enough or would be it would be required for me to go ahead and take up a decision which supports my business. Fine. So this is how I track the information. This is how I get the information. Fine. Uh, my consultancy is located in four different parts of the globe. It's well and good. It would be easy for me to take up the to take the track the information. So just imagine if your consultancy is located in four thousand different locations across the globe. Can we do it in this way? Uh, you can unmute your machine and you can have a discussion. Is it possible for me to? Is it possible for me? to track the information in this way where I can call up each and every consultancy 
at the end of the day and track the information if my consultancy is located in 4000 different locations across the globe okay if i do it if i do it is that a reliable one is that an accurate one no because the information the information is required for me to minute to minute data is required for example if you guys have joined let me mute all if you guys have joined if you guys have joined the us consultancy at this minute in the next minute itself i would like to know how many people have joined in the past minute so this sort of information is required for me to take up a decision because in this competitive market in order to go ahead in order to go ahead in order to take up the decision an automated process is required okay an automated process is required a data warehouse is required where the data is collected from multiple data sources and load the data into the target the target is nothing but a data warehouse okay so hope you guys are clear with the concept of the requirement of the data warehouse i'm sharing my screen joshna i'm sharing my screen uh, the other guys can see the screen so sreelata is asking me to start at from the beginning so i'll just i'll just try to summarize the thing what i have disconnected what i have uh, uh, discussed okay fine uh, so sreelata we have just started uh, discussing about a data warehouse so this is an etl testing class okay and etl is nothing but where you extract the data from the source transform the data and load the data into the target fine and uh, extract the data in the source in the sense the data is available in the source we extract the data a uh, transform the data i let you know what exactly a transform means here we extract the data and load the data into the target okay so what why is that necessary to extract the data when the data is available at one place why is that you want to extract the data and load it in the other place so does it, i mean is that make a meaning does it make a sense so why when what makes us to extract the data and works makes us to load the data into the other place the requirement is in such a way that so i have started up a source is not a data warehouse source is not a data warehouse target is data warehouse when so uh, the example which i have given it a minute back is so i have started up a consultancy my consultancy is located in four different parts of the globe four different parts of the globe so one consultancy has started in us the other consultancy has started in uk the other consultancy the third consultancy has started in india and the fourth one has started it in germany fine so i have started up my consultancy in four different parts of the well of the world fine uh, well if you, you you guys are residing in us so if you guys are residing in us you will be joining in the us consultancy and the guys who are residing in uk they will join uk uk consultancy likewise india and germany fine so as a ceo of my consultancy as a as a chairman of my consultancy what i need to know is so how many people have joined my consultancy right away okay so till date how many people have joined my consultancy and how much revenue is my us consultancy is generating daily so this information is required for me to take up the decisions to support the decisions which i have take which which i used to, i mean we have to take and so on what basis i should take the decision so if I, if if you if you know that if i know that the us consultancy is making much much better so which means that there is a lot of demand for uh, in my uh, uh, there is a lot of demand for the software in us that is the reason why i have to start up i have to expand my us consultancy so in order to make up these decisions a uh, data is required information is required fine so uh, it, it where where will i get the information so the information so when you guys join the us consultancy your information would be taken up by my receptionist okay so they'll take up your information would be taken by my receptionist and uh, that information only the required uh, information from the data which you have given it to my receptionist i'll take that data i'll take that information and i'll use that information to support my decisions well so at the end of the day i'll be taking this information fine at the end of the day i'll be taking this information and i'll be using this information to 
to to to to expand my business or to uh, to 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 support the decisions which i have taken fine uh, if my consultancy is expanded to four locations to 4000 different locations can i do it can i track the information in this way it is not possible for me to track the information in this way so i have to build a data warehouse i have to automate the process when once a so and so associate or the so and so student have joined a particular consultancy at the immediate next minute that information is required for me in the data warehouse which helps me to take up a decision in an efficient way hope you are getting what i what i what i'm trying to say so this is exactly a data warehouse a data warehouse is a place where you so i will extract the data from these four different data sources i'll extract the data from four different sources and i load the data into the data warehouse that is the target so that is the target so this this is a source this is a source this is a target and the transformation happens in middle fine you extract the data from the sources the data you extract it from the sources you transform the data and load the data into the target so this is the necessity of having a data warehouse so we have discussed the necessity of having a data warehouse then what is a data warehouse what is a data warehouse we have discussed about the necessity of having a data warehouse see uh, uh this uh, vanita you are you asking me that all the data can be loaded in an oracle database also why we require a data warehouse data warehouse is built on oracle on i mean one of the place where we build the data warehouse will be oracle oracle teradata so uh, the next question is uh, can you please let me know so many of our students have given testimonials on how our training programs are you will find them on kudzu.com and on our website h2kinfosys.com on our website h2kinfosys.com you will also find more detailed information on who we are the courses that we offer what each course covers also if you're interested in a demo program please register on our home page on the left hand side just give us more information about yourself and we will send you a link for a demo class the demo class is absolutely free experience our commitment by just attending an orientation workshop at no cost Our team of faculty and advisors are here to guide you with the right information. If you still have more questions, please feel free to call us. Call us at 770-777-1269. This is a United States number. If you're calling from the UK, call us at Zero two zero three three seven one seven six one five. You can also email us at training at h two k infosys dot com or h two k infosys at gmail dot com. Thank you for watching our videos. We wish you a great career in information technology.